Welcome, Waffle Warfets. We are back with the brilliant Far Cry 6 on the PlayStation 5. And I hope you guys and girls are having an absolutely fantastic day. Now, in a previous video, we got a couple of things done. Firstly, we did a mission for Philly, where we needed to steal a military truck containing weapons. But Philly didn't want the weapons. He actually wanted the packaging foam, which he is going to use to make some sort of super weapon for us. We then didn't have enough time left to do any more main missions, so what we did instead was we took over both of these checkpoints over here. So the road is a little bit more safer now, and we ain't going to have to worry about bursting our tyres every time we use the main roads. So what we're going to be doing today is we are going to be doing this mission next, which is going to be a mission where I think we want to maybe rescue a few more gorillas, or maybe try to take down Jose Castillo. I can't remember 100%, but this is what we're going to be doing today. So let me just uh, untrack this mission over here involving a chicken because we don't want to be doing that. <laughs> and let's fast travel back here. I might even have enough materials to finally upgrade my hideouts where they will start getting cool vehicles and also uh, chests that you can open each day. So we might have to check that quickly. Yep, there we go. Lovely. So now all of our hideouts are going to have a vehicles and a chest that you can open once a day with cool supplies. And if we upgrade it again, then when we fast travel to our hideouts, it will recharge your Supremo to full charge. And it will also have an even better chest that you can loot every day. Uh, is there any new maps I can buy now? Yeah. Lovely. Okay, I just want to quickly, before I speak to Carlos, I just want to quickly uh, see if I sent Benito out on a mission, because I forgot to do it in the previous video. Oh, a special customer. Awaiting orders, jailbreak. Yeah, this is to get more recruits. Okay, so we can use our oil. We can lose four troops, or we can lose two. This is probably going to not be successful. But if we're successful, we're going to maybe lose some troops, but we'll get 300 coins. Yeah, I feel like this is going to go bad. Yeah. Okay, we failed that one. Oh, now we've got like a negative debuff as well. No, we just want to get through the mission now, I think. Right, we'll go with this one. I feel like it's not going to go well, though. All right. Okay, that's all right. We have to use a bit of water, a bit of gasoline though, which is annoying. Why can't I do that one? Oh, I don't have enough gasoline to do that one. Oh, this one's got a. Oh, it's got a lot of metal though. But this one's also got a lot of plastic. Right, we're gonna go with this one. Actually, we're going to go with this one. If we fail it, we fail it. It's a 50-50. I'm most likely going to fail it because I've got very bad luck, but let's try it. If we fail it, we're only going to get... Well, we're literally going to get nothing from this mission. I didn't get that 300 coins because that failed. And the other one I didn't get anything from. Yeah, so we're probably going to... Yeah, if we don't get this, we're going to get nothing. 50-50, of course I would fail. I've got 19 resources, I guess. Like 19 metal. Yeah, that was a terrible mission. Yeah, I got really shafted with that one. Well, we got some stuff, I suppose. Right, we'll do we'll do this one next. Got to wait an hour until we can actually click it. We got 90 pesos and we got 90 metal. And we recruited nine recruits somehow. Oh, well, well okay, that's good. <laughs> but we did suffer a few losses. All right, let's speak to Carlos. How many times are we going to bail them out, Papa? When does it end? Camila, this is family. I say we cut our losses. Well, you don't get a say because this isn't your fucking camp. What's going on? Jose got our people. He's going to hand them in Verdera Square. Their own fucking fault they got cut. No. It's your fault. How many times have I told you they need to learn what it is to be a guerrilla from us? But you, you never listen. To get faith, you have to give it. I don't like it. So what? We're just going to leave them behind? Mierda. I know what that's like. Small pack. Us five. 
We go in, grab our people, kill whoever gets in our way. Jose's going to have military. We will need eyes on them. Well, the, the church got a built tower. You can see everything from there. Stay the night in the tower before the execution. Don't want anyone seeing you get up there. Got just a thing for you, Hiro. Billy rifle with a high power scope. I'll plant the gun. Miguel, me, and Camila at the square. Philly waits at the radio tower. And on cell phones. Pero hasta el final, Camila. Chorizo! Okay, so we've got to rescue a couple of our boys. Alright. So, I think... Yeah, I think this might be... Yeah, this is the same. If you if you want to do this mission, you probably what you could do is you're going to get a mission over here from a woman and she's going to ask you to steal a tank. And then after you've stealed the tank, she's going to faff around with it a bit. And then you need to take that tank into this city and blow up a bunch of billboards, if I remember correctly. So you might want to do this mission now. Like, I'm not going to do it. But you could do this mission now, then do the second mission at the same time. Because then you can take the tank after you've done the first mission, and then take the tank into the city, blow up all the billboards, and then you can keep the tank. And you don't have to return to her or anything. And then you can go straight into doing this mission. So you could kill two birds with one stone if you want to. Right, I think I should have the uh, the helicopter over here now. So we're going to grab it. I mean, it is it is in a um, uh, anti-aircraft gun zone, but I don't know where the anti-aircraft gun is at the moment. It's not hard to find them. Just fly around and you'll see them far away because they're big. But um, yeah, let's see. Now we've got a little helicopter and we will also have a chest we can loot every day over here. I don't know if there's one of these at every hideout that you can loot every day. I think there might be, to be honest. Bloody hell, ten of each. Very nice. I'm hearing some strange rumors about La Triada Mural. Maybe it's worth checking out. Thank you. Okay, what is it? Oh, okay. A treasure hunt. Lovely. They're monitoring the airspace. Better stay grounded here. I don't give a shit about no restricted airspace. This airspace is restricted. Who's flying that thing? Ah, perfect. I get up really high. Couldn't have been easy to pay. Yeah, we can use our wingsuit. Right, use a wingsuit now. <laughs> you see those little explosions? That was them shooting at me. It doesn't really give you a proper visual representation when you're being shot at. <laughs> but we've got to go to the bell tower and we're going to spend the night in the bell tower waiting for the execution to happen of our troops the next day. So we're going to be sleeping in a bell tower tonight. So not going to be a very good night's sleep. But then we've got, we've got a high-powered rifle that... Philly's got for me, and that new guy we rescued from Jow, he's left it in the bell tower for me, and then we can use Carlos. it to snipe all the dickheads. Near the church. Oye, it's Miguel. Miguel? Where's Carlos? He's busy. Can you get to the bell tower? I think so. Good. I left the rifle up there for you. Stay low. Don't let the soldiers see you. Okay. Suerte, my friend. <laughs> Fuck me, this is a perfect wingsuit jump. Look at this. Straight where we need to be. Lovely, look at that. That was quality. I wish it was daytime, though. Okay, Jefe, I'm here. I'll keep the engine running. Suerte. Got eyes on Jose. Not shoot until I say. Hello, Yarans! You honor me today with your presence, just as I honor you with mine. These are the fake Yarans, and they have no place here in our. As punishment for their crimes. They will be hanged from the barrel of Yara's might. Oh. 
What's our move, Carlos? Carlos! Shit. Te pierdo, cabrón. The tower, you idiots. Oh fuck. Ali's gonna die here. We need to move. Espada! I got, I got him. You cover me. Understand? Daddy, we gotta get him the fuck out of here. Okay, this is, um, if you don't remember, this is, this is Camilla's brother. So I guess Carlos is now dead. Fantastic. And somebody gave me a dud rifle. That, that cutscene was very weird because it didn't have any music. <laughs> Sorry about that, Wolf Wolf You know, you can blame the music companies. I can't trust the music in Far Cry games. I'm stuck with my pistol at the moment. At least I've got unlimited pistol ammo for now. At least I've also got unlimited uh, grenades as well. Look at my dog being kicked out of there. What a motherfucker. Oh, right in the head. Come on, Camilla. Oh. Oh, very nice. I gotta loot this stuff. I know I should be rushing, but you know, I need all I need my stuff. <laughs> okay. Come on, come on, Camilla. Move them ass cheeks, come on. Come on! <laughs> oh man, she's looking low on health as well. Nah, that's not good. I ain't got time to revive you. I have to put bloody Angerado down. Having a quick cigarette and just burning myself a little bit, mate. Don't worry. <laughs> Beautiful. What's his health like? Oh shit, it's very low. Quick, there's a tank over there, come on. Oh, 
Oh, thank God. This bit is an absolute nightmare. Make sure you use your, you use your grenades for all the cars if possible. But um, don't use your Supremo, your rocket launcher Supremo if you've got it. Save it for when the helicopters appear. Unless you've brought a rocket launcher. I've not brought a rocket launcher because so I don't have one yet. But you want to save it for the... Uh... This bit's a nightmare. I fucking hate this bit. I ain't got the right guns or anything. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. Yeah, I'm dead. I was using my bloody pistol like an idiot as well. <laughs> God damn it. Alright, let's try this again. I'll stay down a bit. Lovely, I think we blew off the tyres. Oh, sweet, okay. Wanna watch out for the, uh, quad bikes because they're so flipping fast what happened back there Where's Carlos? we lost him Go to hell. Uh, Papa. already well, there you go I don't think that's supposed to appear that quick I swear that chopper don't appear that quick there'll be another one but I think, I think you should be alright with that one. You should get back to the camp before the next one will cause any problems. Stay with me, Ali. Beautiful. Stay with me. Oh, there's another helicopter. And I don't have a Supremo now. Yeah, I don't know why there was, that other one shouldn't have been there. Well, we're going to end up dead then. Stay with me, It's all on his grenade throws, to be honest. Yeah, this is going horribly wrong. shouldn't have been there. I don't know what the hell happened there. That was weird. Like, that's the first one that should appear and then you take it down. Unless there was just one in the area. Yeah, that one should definitely have not been there. The grenades are the uh, key to winning this, to be honest. Unless you've got a rocket launcher. I should have brought a rocket launcher. I don't have one. I haven't even bought one yet. <laughs> that's the problem. Let's hope that uh, that bloody helicopter don't appear again. Oh, hello. I suppose if you keep replaying this mission, I suppose you'll get more uh, experience to rank up on that, so that's good. <laughs> Yeah, there ain't no helicopter this time, I don't think. 
Yeah, I don't know what the hell happened there. That was weird. Also, I didn't see this quad bike before either, did I? Oh, fuck, that was a good one. Yeah, I think there was just something wrong there, and I don't know what happened there. I just got screwed over, basically. Should be a helicopter soon. This is the one you want to take down with your Supremo. Wait until you pass this car first so you don't accidentally aim at that car. Because your Supremo goes where it wants to go. Right, now do it. I don't know what flipping out happened there. He didn't shoot him as soon as I told him to. He's being a bit of a twat then. He just wants me to fail this mission, I think. There should be another one. Yeah, you're going to have to ignore this one. I mean, you might be able to hide from it if you're crouching like me. I don't know if he's seen me or not. But you'll know when you're safe because Philly says that he's like some of your boys are here or something. Mind you, Philly crashed into my uh, helpers last time and got me killed. Okay, I don't know if he knows where I am or not. Yes. We got backup from the camp. Ah, yeah. Don't crash into him, though, Philly. He crashed into one of their cars last time and it was a mission foul because he blew his own car up. <laughs> I don't know what happened, it was weird. Oh, I think we've done it. Okay, well, that was a bit of a nightmare, but we did it. What the fuck happened to you, Danny? You were supposed to cover up. The rifle jumped. Miguel left me a defective gun. Fuck! I knew we couldn't trust that piece of shit. They knew we were coming. The whole thing was a setup. Bingo! Stay with me, hermanito. Dale, dale! Get him on the table. Uh, is he breathing? His heart stopped. Hang on, Ale. Philly? Give me a minute! Whatever you're thinking, Camila, don't. How do you know it wasn't your brother? We already know he's a fucking traitor. And what about Philly? He's the one who knows explosives. Espada! You saved your papa, but didn't think once to save me. You left me to die in that fucking camp. Billy, I think we're losing him! You think your papa had it bad? Think of what Jose can do to a man when he has the time. Stand back, Hero! I could have given up this whole fucking camp, but I didn't! Fucking Monteros. We're all dead, Camila. Castillo's already won. He's breathing! It's Bada! Balance your stance. A lion finds calm before the kill. See, Papa. Mm -hmm. Fire me! Ah! Que bien, uncle. <laughs> well, now you have heard of our great victory in the West. Carlos Montero is dead. His guerrillas on the run. The tobacco fields secure. Bien. Bien. Your cousin, 
seeks praise, Diego. If I knew his plan, I would have told him that the Montero roots run deep in the farmlands. Two hundred years. What? Yes, Uncle, I was trying to surprise you. Diego, how many of your uncle's soldiers come from the farmlands? Eighty percent, Papa. Correct. And now... He has made a martyr of the most famous Montero. <laughs> Let's see how many of his soldiers want to rebuild paradise now. Por favor. I, I, you killed my son's last bird. Run. What? Run. Beautiful. I love that uh, Camilla actually believed what I said and was just so willing to slice that dickhead's throat. Ah, uh, if you open the map now, watch. This is what happened a few videos back, but I never actually showed you. As you progress through the game, the ranks of everything goes up and becomes more difficult as you level up, so does the world. Which is a bit of a nuisance, actually, but yeah. But as you can see, like the level 9 area with the skull, if we go there, we're going to have a horrific time. And if you go to the rank 8 areas, you're going to have a horrific time. Bit of a flipping nightmare. But uh, we should still be okay. Oh, it looks like there's another anti-aircraft gun over there. I like how Diego couldn't shoot those birds, but the second he had to hu shoot a human, he suddenly got a very good aim. I thought that, when I first played this, I thought that scene was where, like, Jose was going to get killed or something, but no, he doesn't get killed. So it was just like a warning, I guess. But uh, because Jose has now killed Carlos, all of the people in this area that love Carlos that were originally like going with uh, Anton to uh, you know join his paradise and join his army and stuff to you know be part of what he believes in. Now nah, because he's killed Carlos Montero, a lot of people in this area are going to be pissed, so they're less likely to want to voluntarily join him. You know, which obviously they don't have a choice either way because they'll be killed if they don't. But yeah, now they won't voluntarily join, so it'll cause more problems for Anton. Right, I don't have enough time to do another mission, so I think what we're going to do is I think I'm going to um, possibly quickly come over here and take down this anti-aircraft cannon. Because I think every time I go to... I think I go to this hideout quite a lot, and I'm always going to be shot at, so we might as well just do this. But yeah, Carlos is dead now. Which is unfortunate. And we've rescued our brother, but he was... I don't, I don't understand why he was being hung. Because he was working for... He was a scientist working for... Um, working for Jose. So I don't know. I don't know. Maybe maybe they were disappointed with his work or something. Who knows? Claro. But yeah. We walked right into a trap. Carlos is dead and the brother Alejandro isn't doing much better. Danny, you can't let that family fall apart. We don't just need the Monteros to take down Jose. We need them to take Esperanza and put his Uncle Anton in the ground. See, Clara. I'll find a way. Lovely. What's up, Danny? There's a convoy that always passes by Via de Vedera. Make sure those supplies don't get through. Appreciate it. Thank you. I don't really care about the convoys. Or rather you tell me the locations of like FND bases and anti-aircraft guns and stuff like that. I don't really go after the convoys very often. I don't think I've gone after a convoy at all off camera, thinking about it. I'm going to use my wingsuit, because I don't think they shoot at me when you use the wingsuit, which is funny. You'd think, you'd think they'd still shoot at you, because you're still uh, an object flying in the air. But I suppose, they, well, they probably could track a human, couldn't they? Flying through the air with their radars. They still detect a human flying through the air. And even if they don't detect it, they'd easily see it. Doesn't look like there's anywhere for me to jump from, so I'm just going to have to run over there. It doesn't take long to take down his anti-aircraft guns anyway. Once this is done, I'm going to have to end it for today. Oh no, here we go. Here's a mountain. Just make sure you hold up on the analog stick. So that you keep more level, so you get more distance. If you press down, you aim straight into the floor. Because <laughs> it's the opposite controls of the planes, so sometimes it's very easy to get confused. Careful here. 
So we've got three, three beautiful headshots. Oh shit. Oh, the tank nearly saw me. We definitely don't want to be spotted by one of those bastards. Why did it come over here? What did I do? Oh no, I can't see the map. Come on, hurry up. I need to grab that depleted uranium. Oh, I think it's going away. Jesus, I don't know why the flipping hell he decided to come over then. I'm going to assume he saw the dead bodies. They're all coming over here. Alright, oh, the tank's gone now, so we can go crazy. Oh, there you go, they're all dead. <laughs> Lovely. Alright, we've got some more depleted uranium. A map. Lovely. Okay, right. I'm going to have to end the video now, Wolf Wolf Bits. So thanks for watching, Wolf Wolf Bits. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. Next time, I think we might need to speak to Camilla's brother, and I think he might have a mission for me. But there's a lot of stuff we're going to need to do now that Carlos has died. But yeah, thanks for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. Like, share, and join the pack today.